Hey everybody, Milton Davis here. It is week three of our virtual vendors showcase. And today I wanted to talk to you guys about a couple of books that we have on special this week. And those books are Dark Universe. Let it come into focus a little bit. There you go. And Dark Universe by the Empire. Uh, just to give you a little background on uh, both of these books. Um, you know, um, when we write science fiction and fantasy, our, um, our inspiration comes from different sources. Um, and especially as we write it as uh, black creators, um, we are finally getting the opportunity, uh, where we're creating the opportunities where we're writing a lot of fiction and fantasy based on um, our um, own uh, experiences and our own histories and stuff. And so that's one of the reasons that uh, we decided to do the Dark Universe, the Dark Universe uh anthologies because it came from a, a, a different perspective it came from the um the uh, energy of studying and understanding different african empires on the continent we're talking about ghana we're talking about mali of course we're talking about kemet and we're talking about some of the other empires that existed on the continent during that time and that's the kind of energy that drove the creation of this particular anthology you know when we think about science fiction and fantasy um, the thing we're thinking about is like, um, let's, when we're looking at the future, instead of looking at the future as uh, um, taking what we see our current circumstances or our past circumstances, at least um, when it comes as far as the diaspora is concerned, um, as a basis, let's look back even further. Let's look into our, uh, our past as, on the continent. And um, looking at these empires, we said, let's take that and let's project that into the future. Let's imagine what an uh, uh, Afrocentric galactic empire would look like and um, imagine the stories that we could tell from that background. And I got together with Gene Peterson, and we sat down and we developed this whole background for what we ended up calling the Dark Universe. Now, once we developed the background and, and came up with the storylines and different things like that, um, we just did, normally what we do is we do a open call when it comes to anthologies, but in this case, we didn't. We really wanted to go to authors that we knew who were like great science fiction writers, and we knew they would be able to take a look at what we had developed and develop some great stories in it. And that's what we basically got. Um, the line basically right now has two anthologies. There's a first opening anthology, which is, again, the Dark Universe anthology. And this anthology is actually like a broad scope of the Empire. It basically starts from the origin. The first story is actually the, the, is the initial beginning of how the Empire came to be. And we go through the entire span of the 1,000 years of the, what we call the Kassad the Empire. And we had some great authors that took part of this. I just want to read you some of the authors. If you're familiar with uh, Black Speculative Fiction and familiar with the indie authors as well, you'll, you'll, some of these names will very, be very familiar to you. We got a story in here by Ronald Jones, by Milan Edwards, K. Cerise Wright, Balogun Ojitade, uh, Penelope Flynn, um, Gene Peterson under his pen name Howard Knight and Devon Sanders and we went to these specific authors because we knew they under, they would understand what we were doing and they would be able to bring some amazing stories to the, to the anthology which they did now the second anthology Dark Universe the Bright Empire actually came from a conversation that we were having when we were discussing doing the next the next anthology and it was actually expressed by Penelope Flynn she was like you know we've got this great empire and we are writing these stories based on this empire. And it seems like we're only focusing on one aspect of the empire. So what we decided to do is that we decided to create an anthology that would have stories reflecting the heyday of this empire. For the Kassad Empire is at its zenith. And it's basically controlling um, over the, the entire um, known universe. We call it the known. And which means that they're controlling uh, planets that were basically originated as... Um, government planets and different things like that but now they're all under the control of the uh Kassad empire and of course we got um great author authors for this book as well um, we got tade thompson uh balogun ojitade again uh Baljan jeffers uh robert jeffrey gerald coleman um, hannibal taboo and, a Pe and penelope flynn again and again we got an, a good collection of great stories uh that um to to talk about this empire and describe it in more detail. Um, we also, right now, we're working on a third anthology that will be coming out next year. And that's gonna be Dark Universe, the um, the new regime. 
And uh, this is another one that will be continuing the legacy and the stories of the Empire. Um, and uh, we have probably at least two more anthologies that will be coming off again, all of them based on this particular Galactic Empire and some novels that will be coming out as well. So, of course, this is being my vendor's table month. Um, all of my books are on sale. Um, these particular books are on sale for 40% off, um, which is a really good deal on these books. We all have a limited inventory of the paperbacks. So, of course, first come, first serve. But also, the ebooks are on sale as well. We have uh, EPUB versions and we have Mobi versions. So, take a chance, you know, take, take some time, go check our website out, go visit, uh, go visit us and check out The Dark Empire. I think you guys will enjoy it very much. Uh, it's Milton Davis signing off. Take care. Peace.